Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here. And in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I couldn't help myself. I wanted to make one more today before the end of the old generation era. And today I'm going to be talking about some of the new vehicles that are going to be coming to you guys who have played on the 360 and PS3 when you jump over to the PS4 and Xbox One. We're going to be talking about the Kraken sub, the Cheval monster truck, the blimp, the Dodo seaplane, the stallion, and a whole lot more. So that's right, tomorrow is a new era for at least content on my channel. I'm going to be covering all the next generation content. So I guess this could be for, I guess a, a little bit, the last old generation video I kind of do on my channel. But it's going to be great. I cannot wait to continue doing GTA 5 videos like this and it should be an amazing time. So let's get the video started. So the Cheval monster truck is going to run you $500,000 in Grand Theft Auto Online, which is about $242,000 cheaper than the Liberator. And also one other thing to note, the Cheval monster truck is also slightly customizable. Now you can't bring it into the Los Santos custom shop, but you can select which nationality of a flag you can put on your vehicle, which will change the certain color and of course the flag on the back. Now the Kraken sub is fairly expensive. It is gonna run you $1.325 million. So to go exploring, and I guess the new Kraken sub in GTA Online, it's gonna set you back $1.3 million. Pretty hefty for something that you can only use for like sea exploration. Now something else that kind of can be used for sea exploration is the Dodo seaplane. And like the Cheval monster truck, that is also going to set you back $500,000. That's right. The Dodo seaplane is going to be $500,000 in GTA Online. So definitely get your shark cards ready or start saving up or selling cars because these vehicles are definitely expensive and are going to set you back a little bit. Now the Stallion is going to cost you $71,000. So pretty cheap for a car like that. The Ballista Compact is going to cost you $42,000. And finally, the Dukes is going to cost you $62,000 in GTA Online. So the cars are a little less expensive than the monster truck and the submarine and the Dodo seaplane. But nevertheless, that's going to net you about two and a half to three million dollars right there if you want all those vehicles in GTA Online. So again, I know it was a short video, but it's going to be the last one before next generation. I'm still enjoying my time on GTA 5. Hopefully you guys are as well. Tomorrow begins a new era on my channel of next generation content. Hopefully you guys are ready, and if you are, definitely leave a like on the video, that would be amazing. And also subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new, or you like daily Grand Theft Auto 5 videos like this. Without the way, guys, like I said, thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.